I know that because you were such a large part in starting AEW that a lot of people might forever look at you as an AEW guy. I thought that documentary sort of highlighted mm. that you view WWE as home. That's where you started. You decided in the dark. You did. You said that it was your home. <laughs> and I, I think that as things grow, like people are starting to become more accustomed to that. At what point did you fully realize, oh, this is home? Or did you know all along? Night after WrestleMania in Dallas. Night after WrestleMania in Dallas, I saw so many um, kids in the crowd who didn't care about what I'd done for three years and didn't care about the 10 years before that. They were present, they were in the moment, they thought this guy who came out of WrestleMania was Cluey and they were gonna be part of it and they liked the energy. And it was at that point I, I really felt like, oh, the thing you've been seeking, you know, cool moves, great, wonderful promos, great, you know, trying to make them one cool, you know, trying to hit home runs with everything. But that connection is is what we do. It's what, and it's why guys and girls get into it. And it's why they also can't walk away, you know, and why it's so fun to, to come back to. But that night after WrestleMania, I knew uh, something special was happening and I, I'm, I'm here for it. And you, you've been heavily cheered ever since then, uh, beloved. And I'm sure you've seen it. People are like, oh, well, will this cause him to get booed? Yeah. Will this cause him? And it hasn't, waiting. It hasn't happened. <laughs> what What is sort of your diagnosis to that, to that adjustment from AEW, where you got booed quite a bit, to WWE, where you're yeah. some of the most insane reactions I've ever heard when a note of your music hits? I really, uh, in both places, I really... The reactions were wild and uh, the uh, Arthur Ashe Stadium, I remember, I just thought this is, is there. In a way, I think, in a way you think this is the coolest thing ever because, it, you know, people, there's this narrative that people really want to push that, uh, that we weren't trying for that. No, you were absolutely trying for that. <laughs> and it was happening and it was fun. And, uh, and I, I enjoyed it. The, not to the degree that I enjoy this, just because this is kind of times a hundred in a sense of, and it's no matter what time in the night uh, when it happens, and just despite it, there's just something special um, about about it here. But I I don't really have one that I, I favor. I, I think I think the thing I favor is still kind of being built, it's still kind of happening. I think the ultimate reaction, the ultimate pop. And it doesn't come every night. It comes maybe even once, once in a career, once in a lifetime. And that's what I'm trying to, to build into.